Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name's Step Spacing, and welcome to Let's Play Prey, the demo, because I don't have the game. Um, I think it's coming out soon. I'm pretty sure it's like this week or next week or something like that. But this demo, I, I, I wanted to play it because I've been looking forward to this game because I've seen some previews for it, and I'm like, this looks pretty awesome, dude. I gotta check this out. So, demo, let's play. Uh, pre-order Prey today. No, I want to demo. So if I can pre-order it, I guess that means it's not out yet. But it looked interesting, so I'm like, I gotta play this. Because, you know, you see the guy with the eye, and it's like, oh my god, what's that? Ooh, it's so creepy. Launch demo! Campaign thoughts. One! Uh, normal. Thank you. This kind of reminds me of Fallout right here. Oh, neat! I was wondering why they were both MU. Ah, you know what? What the heck? I'll be the lady this time. I haven't been a lady in forever. Except for... Was that one game I played? You wake up in your apartment in the year 2032. That's not too far away, actually. I'll still be alive then. I'll be old as a fart, but I'll still be alive. How old will I be in 32? Born in 2015. I'll be 47. I won't be that old. I'll still be in my prime. Yeah, that'll be awesome. Very androgynous name. Ooh. What does it say? Oh, it says March. I thought it said April for a second there. Huh. What are you? Oh, sorry for the talk in the background. I got my window open. What's up, Alex? Are you my dad? Alright. Hey, no problem, dude. No problem. Heck yeah. First day on the job. You begin with an objective. Press that to open your transcribe. Oh, Jesus. That's unpleasant. Uh, Alex convinced me to join him on board Talos 1. No, I guess not my dad if I'm calling him Alex. Uh, the work we're doing up there is too good to pass up. Plus, he says he's got a surprise. I have to jump through some hoops in the training center before I board the shuttle. Yay. Sounds good. What is these? Okay. Oh, Jesus. Whoa. That was a lame throw. Ooh, play video games. Heck yeah. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, okay, here we go. An accountant firmies, uh, accountant firm, uh, except from a book in the existence of extraterrestrial intelligence, such as Robert James III. Consider that there are billions of stars in the galaxy, like our sun, many of them far older. Some of these stars will have Earth-like planets. Some of them, some of these planets may have developed intelligent life. Some intelligent life may be developed for interstellar travel. If a civilization began before ours, it seems possible, even probable, that even at the speed of currently envisioned interstellar travel, they could already have an entire galaxy colonized. Problem is, we haven't detected any such civilizations, nor have any contacted us. Why? Because they've seen us and they're like, ugh, gross. Uh, principles of neuroscience, ooh. Uh, the brain was once considered too warm, wet, and noisy for seemingly delicate quantum processes. However, the discovery of quantum coherence in biological processes, such as plant photosynthesis, avian navigation, and our own sense of smell paved the way for eventual discovery of quantum vibrations inside the microtubules of neurons. Interesting, says the nerd. Huh. Well, that's me. Maybe brother? Ooh, very Japanese. Jeez, that thing must be heavy. Meh. <laughs> uh, light switch. Boink. Whoa. Shower time. Sh shower time. Shower time. Sh shower time. Shower time. Oh, yeah. Ooh, my face. Probably should have closed the door first. Don't want to get my carpet wet. Oh, don't leave it on. 
There we go. Ooh, look at it flush. Toilet physics, they're best. Draw, dry myself up. I took a shower in my clothes. I'm a doof. Going. Ooh, neat. Be gone. <laughs> ah, be gone. I'm making tea. <laughs> I'm making tea in a very violent way. Ooh, Kingsway sparkling wine. Let's have a drink. Uh oh. I can get drunk. Oh no. Congrats, Morgan. Alex. Thanks, Alex. Oh. I get sober quick. Ooh. She got a nice rice cooker. Oh, nice. Look at this thing. Go away. Why are you having such a fit there, Morgan? Oh. Can I go outside? Aw. There's a door jam. I want to go up there. It's pretty. Ooh. It's pretty out there. Alrighty. Hey. Just got off the phone with mom and dad. Yep. Knew it. My brother. Huh. They won't be there when uh, the shuttle departs. They're in New York. Company stuff. But they'll send their best. I think mom's a little disturbed that both the children are going to be outside a gravitational pool at the same time. Helicopter mom. Or I guess tiger mom. Me. Eh. So there you go, that's mom. Anyway, everyone's excited about your ideas up here, ready to vote, probably call you in the morning and make sure we see you very, very soon, yes. Whoppa! Wow, those towels made it far. Floop! <laughs> oh, that's far too enjoyable. Alright. First day on the job, put on my uniform. That took a lot longer than it probably should have. <laughs> Pretty neat looking suit. All right, get to the helicopter on the roof, okay. Lock the door. Hello, maintenance lady, jeez. Heard there's a chopper on the roof. Must be for you. I bet. So X to jump, L3 to sprint, and slide while sprinting. Sweetness. Ooh. Hey, you know where Dory's at? I'm trying to find her. She went to go find her family. But she didn't realize that it was her family with her all Oh, water... No wonder the water wasn't running very well. Take me away. I don't want to wait. Waiting's boring. Sweet. Oh, neat. I can get closer. That's good to Boot the door open. Bah! Ooh. That's a pretty helicopter. So far, I really want this game now. I mean, it's Bethesda, so I kind of figured I would. Because I haven't played a single game of theirs that I didn't enjoy, at least to some degree. Ah, uh, sit down. There we go. Miss you, please make yourself comfortable and we'll be on our way. Roger, roger. Um, facility is just a short hop. But I thought we... Uh, degrees. That's awesome. <laughs> That's awesome. I love that. They've got their brands on the buildings. <laughs> Here's the next one. Come on. Ooh. It's pretty. No denying that. <laughs> sure is an Arcane Studios production. Uh, you know, if you ever watch the show uh, Fringe, I always wonder why nobody ever noticed the big floating words in the city. But then again, if they're always there, then everyone already noticed them. Pray. <laughs> That's clever. I like it. Wow, really was just a short jump away. Hey, look. Pray. Light effects. Thanks, pilot. Roger, Dodger. What the? Where'd the words go? Where'd the word? Where'd the words go? Probably shouldn't jump into the helicopter blades, huh? Oh, that would be funny. <laughs> How'd you die? Oh, try to How'd you die on your first game playthrough of uh, Prey? Oh, I jumped into the helicopter blades. It was awesome. 
Oh. Like you. Robot? I'm a Sybil 495 science class operator. Everyone's eager to see what you're capable of, Dr. Hugh. I know I am. Yeah. You're creepy, mister. More than you. You have a 9 a.m. appointment in the testing facility. The elevator's talking to me. Ugh, I don't like elevators talking to me. Alex, what's up, brother man? Hey. Jesus. You don't look terrible in a trans star uniform. Well, why'd you I'm zoom in so darn close? Still red? I know the test might seem a little unconventional, but that's a new family tradition. Breaking well, convention is an awful lot. Is there a me? You start the test, just family tradition. Natural. Okay. Don't overthink it. Dr. Bellamy's gonna walk you through the process. You're in good hands. Roger. We'll be in orbit next week. Oh, for Christ's sake, can we walk? I promise. Mr. Walk and talk, buddy. Walk and talk. Right. Listen. Just be yourself. I'll see you later. Roger, Dodger, Alex. Good to see you, buddy. Open door. Oh, just too bad it's not red. What's up, Dr. Bellamy? Sure. Alright. Okay. That was pretty lame. I wanted to slide into him. Oh, what's up, bud? Vanished. Synaptic register? At all? No? That's fine. What? Sorry, let's keep things moving, Morgan. Head into room C. We're doing marvelous. You couldn't find me, huh? <laughs> Open door. All right, buddy. Okay. In the, the most natural, intuitive way possible. Without thinking. Just, just go for it. Press the red button when you're ready. Push button. Boom! Record time. I saw exactly what Tina thought now. Did you double check? But they're still on. What's going on? I apologize, Morgan. We're having some trouble with the equipment. Not your fault. You're doing fabulous, actually. One last room. Let's step into D. You guys are weird. Oh, I was pushing the wrong button to run. That's why. Ah, uh, okay. Dumb. Hello. It's me again. Can someone get me a cup of coffee? I would appreciate it. Thank you. Hey, grab me one while you're at it. Okay, Morgan. Have a seat at the table for me, please. Boink. Okay. Wonderful job. Take a look at the screen in front of you. Okay. Let me show you a series of questions. Pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Okay. Press start on the screen when you're ready. Okay. Boink. 
Plan your vacation, go somewhere familiar, you know, I love to try something new. I want to try something new. Uh, you've been sent to death for your actions. How does it make you feel? Did I do it? Don't know what'll happen. Ooh, that's heavy stuff. You don't say. Why don't we try and bear down on five people? You're tired to the track. You can cause the train to switch back. There's one person. Switch tracks. I ain't gonna kill five for the sake of one. Why don't we try and bear down on five people? Standing with an enormously fat man pushing him on the track. Stop the train. What? Well, again, it's one for five. Runaway train is bearing down to five people. You could stop the train by jumping onto the track, but you would die. Again, push the fat man. <laughs> Jump on the tracks. There is no fat man. Uh, I'm impressed. Well done. Again, well, one for five. We nearly it. For this next part, I'm going to display an image. I okay. want you to take a good look at it. In a moment, I'm going to ask you what... What the heck? What the? What? What just happened? Was the coffee attacked? Why is coffee evil? Coffee should never be evil. Alex, what's going on? We have a problem. Yeah, yeah. What the heck just went down with the coffee, man? That was weird. Good morning, Morgan. Today is Monday, March 15, 2032. Do you know what? Wait a minute. Groundhog's Day. Um, what? What? Oh, oh my. You okay? Oh. Nice. I have a weapon. Hello, Marcus. It's time we spoke. Yeah. My code name is January. You're not dreaming. What happened yesterday was real. If you want to know what's going on, first you need to get out of your apartment building. You're not safe. Yeah. I didn't want to carry her. I wanted to loot her. Um, where'd the elevator go? Six unread emails. Danger, leave now. Okay. 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 Stuff just got real, like, real quick. Fix that. Perfect. What about you? It wasn't real. None of it was real. Oh my. Oh my. Okay, good. Roger, Dodger. Oh, I don't like this place. Oh, it's got... 
Creepy. It's creepy, it's creepy. Simulation of the product change in less than costume. Do not interact with subject off script. Word. Huh. Neat. Ah, what was that noise? Oh Jesus! Get away! Get away! Get away! Get away! Get away! What the heck? It's so weird and goopy. Oh god, I don't like it. It's so goopy. Did it die? Yeah, it did. Jesus. Okay. What the heck? Oh, Jesus, this is weird. Uh, sleeping. Wakes up, turns off alarm, checks transcribe on computer, various tasks, takes shower, puts on uniform, exits department. 2035? What? It's 2032, two seconds ago. Uh, I'm gonna put branches, uh, I'm gonna, so, who the heck is Bellamy? At this point, Morgan's exhaustion is inhibiting our ability to get useful results. That same, uh, reflecting constant neuromod. What the heck? Not about this morning. This morning's incident that left people shaking to prevent unnecessary panic. Please refrain from contacting people outside of your department. Decision one announcement will be made shortly. In the meantime, Mr. Ms. Zelazar and her security team are on high alert. Field interviews current showing. Okay, well, that's good to know. Utilities. What? <laughs> What the heck, man? That is awesome. Oh. Marking the entire skew as defective investigation with fabrication marker. Okay. I cop 0876. Reminder about the company. Password protection. Don't share your password. Passwords are sensitive. Do not stick sticky notes of your password on your office computer. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh yes. Yeah, right. Bad install. The results today were all negative. Did you install correct neuro mods? Touch base with Graves and figure out what went wrong. This should be the absolute highest priority. Oh. Save code is. I uh, can't read that. Fine, I don't want to read that anyway. Who, 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 who are the butts do I have to kick? Me. Okay. Oh, okay, that's neat. I don't know why you felt the need to tell me about that now. Close the door. Oh, it's locked open, though. Oh, man. A secret door in my house. Elevator. Oh, okay, this is creepy. Helicopter. Oh, this is creepy. Hello? I heard noises. Oh, that's what I heard.
Um, okay. Guess I'm not going anywhere there. Okay, I know where I am now. Yep, science bag and fake magazine. Oh, come on. Oh, doors open over here. Jesus, that is a nice window. What about this? Yeah, we already read that one. Rooftop entrance. Whoa. It's all green screen. That's pretty cool. Oh my. What the hell? Oh, that's awesome. I've just been picking things up and chucking them. Nice. Whew. All right, all right, all right. Still alive, still alive. <laughs> Dude, no wonder I couldn't tell where that one had come from. Take. Nice. Boink. That wasn't throw. <laughs> Morgan's behavior. Alex requests all orders go through him after Morgan's outburst at the, the debrief. Thank you, Psyche Bell. Alex indicated that he doesn't want any more surprises from Morgan, nor do we. Granted, Morgan had forgotten everything from the last test, as expected, but the aggressive response to the same set of testing criteria was clearly departure recommendation. Bell, and you have Oh, the coffee mugs. That's why. Uh huh. where I got drugged at. Okay. Oh boy. Next is lobby, skill recorder. What? I... Oh. Oh. What the heck? Oh, that's not good. Next week's test, Terra A area effect, copycat, spooky action. Let's know if we need anything urgent. Hey, I think Bellamy's taking data related to mimicry and remote manipulation out of the research bank at the trauma center and grab the key card off his cabin, uh, to his cabin off his body. I'm sorry to be morbid, but Alex will lose his if someone else finds the data. Okay. Okay. Neat. Moving on. Play your way. Uh, experiment with different approaches to overcome challenges and enemies. You can get past the locked door by searching for the key card or finding an alternate path. As you learn new abilities, more options will become available to you. Neat. I guess that's the alternate path. Hello? Jesus. Yeah, I knew it was you, punk.
Okay, that's not what I meant. Health kit. Uh, use. <laughs> that's right, punk. Ha. Ah. These guys are awesome. Which has fun, Billy, blah, blah, blah. There's like four of them there, wasn't it? What? Hey, buddy. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna take a look at that and just leave. Oh my goodness. What the heck is going on? What the heck? Oh, yes, please. <laughs> So the glue cannon. What are you doing up there? Ah, oh, there we go. Have a melee shot or something? I'm there. Gotcha. Roger, Dodger. Shotgun shells? This means there's a shotgun nearby? Oh, golly. Alright. Huh. Take. Neuro mods and abilities. Open transcribe neuro mod selection. Gotcha. Oh, neat. Scientist, engineer, security. Oh, I like that. Awesome. Let's take that. <laughs> oh, I don't like that. Ouch. My eye. Also, I appear to have slid. Next, blue cannon. Travel. Yes. And then we get a loading screen. Oh my god, dude, that went from zero to oops, sorry. That went from zero to sixty in like two seconds flat. I'm like, Jesus. What all is going on here? My goodness. Oh I get though. I'm intrigued. I'm beyond intrigued. I'm excited. <laughs> Ooh, those are creepy signs. Hey, buddy. Ready for your first real view of the world? Oh, no. 
He died in a very unfortunate way. But he gave me a shotgun, so can't be too upset. Oh. Uh, I'm not on Earth. What? Oh, 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 I'm getting alien isolation vibes now. The funny part is I just got my shotgun on alien isolation as well. What's the shimmy shakes? Oh, Jesus. That's an explosion. Yeah. A few. All right, where am I going? All right, where am I going? Where am I going? Up there. Okay. How do I get over there? Go up another floor, maybe. Jesus. Nope. Maintenance. Um, maybe? Oh, I didn't even think about that. Check me out with my big brain. Ah, oh, poop. What the hell? Ah. Oh. Oh, no. I fell. Saw the other one. Where was it? Nope. Boom. <laughs> ah. I knew one of them was it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Out of shotgun ammo now. Wrench. Ah. Funky monkey. How do I get up there? Stop it. Flickering at me. Oh, that's how I fell through. Okay. Good news is there doesn't seem to be any fall damage in the game, which is good because I tend to always fall and damage. You there, lady. Dead lady. Cookies, more waste. Trauma center executive office. Third floor. Okay, that was unexpected. Get stoned. Boop. Ha. Ah. Ah, can't aim down the barrel with this thing. Nice. Awesome. Right. Um. Oh my God, hot boss. <laughs> Zero four five one, gotcha. Z 
zero four five one. Nailed it. Welcome to my office. Welcome back. This has been your home for the last three years. Thanks, January. Nice. I got the plan and the quest Jason, thank you. Same password. Uh. Hello. Jeez. Hello, Morgan. Hello, Morgan. Right? Yeah. If I'm talking to myself, it must be. <laughs> Your memory shot full of holes. I know. I'm sorry, but <clears throat> it's permanent. So the first thing you need to know is you can trust January. It's an operator, a sort of backup of you and me. Okay. It knows what you forgot. We've been testing a new kind of neuromod based on the type of organisms, mapping their neural patterns onto ours. Problem is, when you uninstall a neuromod, it resets your memory back to the moment you first put it in. That's why you forget. Uh. There's supposed to be a process that brings you back up to speed between test runs. But someone could just skip that part, turn a single day into your entire life. Well, that's exactly what Alex did. Question is, why? That's a good question. You're not going to like what I have to say next. Uh oh. Uh oh. Come on. Why not? good i'm actually going to leave this episode here i might i mean my, that might mean that i'm not gonna be able to play it again but jeez i mean i've already been going for an hour and uh my phone my, my my recording software doesn't like me going for more than 55 minutes at a time but jesus this game is awesome oh, it's amazing i can't wait to play this game man i hope this comes out soon because i want to play the heck out of it jesus ah uh, anyway Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please go ahead and poke that like button for me. If you feel the need to, you can comment down below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can, when I can, if I can. You know all that jazz. And, uh, yeah, tune in next time when, oh, <laughs> stuff and things, man. Oh. And until then, night.